Hello Junior 3, how are you? I hope to be well. Let's start our math session. Chapter 5, Lesson 1. Finding the area in different strategies. Today we will study new strategies to get the area of rectangle. At first, area of rectangle given its dimensions. What the meaning of dimensions? We will know what is the meaning of dimensions. We can use the formula to find the area. At first, this is rectangle, okay? Here we have length. This is length of rectangle. And this is width of rectangle, okay? Then this is called length and this is called width okay length and width are two dimensions of rectangles then what is the meaning of dimensions dimensions means length and width length and width okay if I want to get the area by using formula what is the formula of the area formula of the area is length times width length times width okay then if I want to get the area of rectangle by using formula then area will be length times width okay for example the dimensions of the rectangle are 7 cm length and 4 cm width okay if I have rectangle this is called length this is called length which equals 7 cm or 7 squares 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and we have here 4 cm in width or 4 squares 1 2 3 4 okay okay if I want to get the area of rectangle by using its formula we have formula which equal length times width formula of area equal length times width then we can get the area by multiplying length and width okay area equal by using formula 7 times 4 7 times 4 the answer will be 28 square centimeter 28 square centimeter we have important note we can represent the area by two units we can represent the area by two units we use two units the first one centimeter square and the second one meter square then we have two units of area the first one centimeter square and the second one meter square calculating the area using different stretches here we have rectangle let's get its length okay its length 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 squares and its width 1 2 3 4 okay then we have here 6 and we have here 4 okay the first strategy is called repeated addition. Repeated addition, we can make it by using rows and by using columns, okay? I will make it at first by using rows. How many rows? One, two, three, four. We have here four rows, each one has how many squares one two three four five six then we have here four rows 
of six squares. Then we can see six repeated how many times? Four times. Six plus six plus six plus six. Six plus six, twelve. Twelve plus six, eighteen. Eighteen plus six, twenty-four. Twenty-four square units. Or we can make repeated addition by columns. How many columns? Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we have six columns. Six columns. Each one has how many squares? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then we can say six columns of four. Okay? Then Four repeated six times, then we can say four plus four plus four plus four plus four plus four. Four plus four, eight plus four, twelve plus four, sixteen plus four, twenty plus four, twenty four. Okay? The second strategy is called multiply. We can multiply 6 times 4, okay? 6 times 4. Or 4 times 6. At first, we will multiply 6 times 4. From table 6, we will raise 4 fingers. 6, it will be 18, 24. Then the answer will be 24 units. Or we can say 4 times 6. 4 times 6 is also 24 units. The third strategy is called distributive strategy. Okay? Here we can break 6 into can break 6 into 3 plus 3. We can break 6 into 3 plus 3. And we will multiply 3 times 4 plus 3 times 4. Then we will multiply 3 times 4 plus 3 times 4. Okay? The first product will be 12, and the, set, the second product will be also 12. 12 plus 12 will be 24 square units. Exercise. Calculate the area of each rectangle. Number A. Here we have rectangle. Its length 5 cm and its width 3 cm. If I want to get the area, area of rectangle equal length times width. Okay, we will start with length which equal 5 and width which equal 3. Then 5 times 3 equal 15 cm square. Number B. Here we have rectangle. Its length 8 cm and its width 4 cm. Okay, length equal 8 and width equal 4. If I want to get its area, area equal length times width. We start with length which equal 8 and width which equal 4. Then 8 times 4 equal 32 cm square. Number C. This is a rectangle, its length 8 cm and its width 5 cm. If I want to get its area, area of rectangle equal length times width, then we start with length which equal 8 times width which equal 5, 8 times 5 equal 40 cm square. 
complete the following table. Here we have length of rectangle and width of rectangle and we will get the area. We know that area equal length times width, okay? The first rectangle, its length equal 4 cm and its width equal 3 cm. Then the area will be 4 times 3. We will get 12, okay? 12 cm square, okay? The second rectangle, its length equals 7 meter and its width equals 5 meter. We know that area of rectangle equals length times width. Okay, then we will multiply 7 times 5. 7 times 5 from table 5, we will raise 7 fing fingers, okay? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. Then the answer will be 35 meter square, okay? Number 3, here we have 6 meter in length and 2 meter in width. And the area of rectangle equal length times width. Then we will multiply 6 times 2, okay? 6 by 2, okay? From table 6, we will raise two fingers, 6, 12. Okay, then the answer will be 12 meter square. Number 4. Here we have area, area equal 46, uh, 40, sorry, 48, okay? And we have width, width equal 6, okay? Then we want to get length, we want to get length, okay? We know that length times width equal area, okay? What is the number if I multiply it? By 6, I will get 48, okay, from table 6. 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 42, 48. How many fingers? 8. Then length will be 8, okay? Number 5, here we have length equal 3 meter and area equal 6. We know that area equal length times width. Then we will ask ourselves, what is the number? If I multiplied it by 3, I will get 6, okay? From table 3, 3, 6. How many fingers? 2. Then the answer will be 2. Number 3, find the area of each figure in two ways. This is rectangle because we have two different dimensions. The long is length and the short is width, okay? First way, we can say row by column, okay? Or by repeated addition, okay? By repeated addition, how many columns? One, two, three, four, five. Here we have five columns, okay? Each one has three squares. Then we can say three plus three plus three plus three plus three, okay? Three plus three, six plus three, nine. 9 plus 3, 12, 12 plus 3, 15. Then the area will be 15. Here we get the area by repeated addition of columns, okay? Repeated addition by columns, okay? The second way, we can say area of rectangle equal length times width then we can say 5 times 3 from table 5 we will raise 3 fingers 5 10 15 then the area will be 15 square centimeter
Number B. Here we have rectangle. And I want to get its area by using two ways, okay? The first way we can make repeated addition, okay? We can repeat 7 four times. Then we can say 7 plus 7 plus 7 plus 7, okay? Equal 28. Or we can repeat 4 seven times. Then we will say 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4, okay? Then the answer will be 28 square centimeter, okay? The second way, we know that area of rectangle equal length times width. Then we can say 7 times 4. 7 times 4 equal from table 7, we will raise 4 figures, okay? 7, 14, 21, 28. Then the answer will be 28 square centimeter. Area and perimeter. At first, perimeter. Perimeter is the distance around the edge of the shape. We know that. Perimeter, the distance around the shape. Okay? Then perimeter outside the shape. Perimeter outside the shape. Or perimeter means outer sides, the sum of outer sides, okay? Area, the amount of space inside the shape, the amount of space inside the shape, okay? We know that area, the number of squares inside the shape, okay? Then perimeter, outer sides, and the area, the number of squares inside the shape, okay? Exercise. Find the area and the perimeter of the following figures. Number A. Here we have rectangle. Its length is 5 cm and its width is 4 cm or 4 squares, okay? And I want to get its perimeter and its area, okay? At first, if this side equal 5 cm, then the other longest one is also 5 cm. If this side is 4 cm, then the other shortest one is also 4 cm. If I want to get the perimeter of this rectangle, we know that perimeter means outer sides, okay? Then we will add 5 plus 4 plus 5 plus 4. The answer will be 80 centimeter. And if I want to get the area of this rectangle, we know that area equal length times width, okay? Then we will multiply 5 times 4 equal 20 square unit. Or we can say 20 square centimeter, okay? 20 centimeter square, okay? Number B. Here we have another rectangle. Its length 7 centimeter and its width 2 centimeter. And I want to get its perimeter and its area. At first, if the longest one equal 7, then the other longest one will be 7. If the shortest one equal 2, then the other shortest one will be also 2, okay? If I want to get perimeter, then 7 plus 2 plus 7 plus 2, the answer will be 18, okay? And if I want to get the area, area equal length times width, then we will multiply 7 by 2, the answer will be 14, okay? 14 square unit or centimeter square. Number C. 
this is a square because all of its sides are equal in length. If we want to get its perimeter, we know that perimeter the sum of outer sides, okay? Then perimeter equal 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5. The answer will be 20 centimeter. If I want to get area, area of a square equals side length times itself, okay? Or side length times side length. Then we will multiply 5 times 5. The answer will be 25 square units. We can say square unit or centimeter square. Number D. Here we have rectangle because we have two short sides and two long sides. Two short sides and two long sides. Okay. If one of its long sides equal eight, then the other one is also eight. And if one of its shorter sides equal one, then the other will be also one, okay? If I want to get perimeter of rectangle, the sum of all outer sides, eight plus one plus eight plus one, okay? The answer will be 18. And the area of rectangle equal length times width. Length times width. Then the answer will be 8 times 1. 8 times 1 equal 8. Okay? We are finished. Thanks, Junior 3. See you later.